I know, I know. Pumpkin triggers some of you. It seems to be especially bad when it's pumpkin spice. I think pumpkin spice latte is the epitome of fall fair trigger phrases. With that in mind, petite pumpkin spice cookies probably isn't exactly music to some of your ears. But hey, I know you're not going to want to hear this, but you pumpkin haters are a distinct minority. Repeatedly, routinely, across all social media, people taking polls about pumpkin spice respond positively to PS products and say they do want pumpkin and pumpkin spice reviews. It's just under 25% that seem to despise the stuff. So until those polls hit 51% anti-pumpkin sentiment or higher, I'm going to keep buying and reviewing these products. Now, I certainly don't love every pumpkin spice product I try, not by a long shot, nor do I hate every pumpkin product I try. I do get tired of it each and every year by the end of the autumn season, but then I'm always ready for some more 9 or 10 months later. This is only our third new pumpkin item of the season from Trader Joe's, so I'm still more or less in pumpkin spice mode, and Sonia most definitely is too. That said, these cookies are pretty much what I expected them to be. The only thing on the packaging that threw me off a little was where they described these cookies as shortbread. I'm not saying they're not shortbread, but I think gingerbread would have been more accurate in terms of flavor. Sonia likes them a good bit more than I do. They remind her of mother's circus animals, but with cinnamon, nutmeg, allspice, and ginger. She likes them a lot with coffee, and she thinks they'd be fun for kids or office parties. There are white pumpkins with orange nonpareils. Is that how you pronounce that? Nonpareils? And orange pumpkins with white nonpareils. They're yogurty on the outside and crunchy and bready on the inside. Like I said, no surprises here. The pumpkin spice level is fairly well balanced with the sweet coating and the wheat cookie flavors, but these little treats are still just garden variety autumnal snackage by my estimation. $3.99 for the 10 ounce box. Sonia would buy again next year. Four stars from her. I'd eat a couple out of Sonia's box, but I would not feel the need to purchase my own. Three out of five stars for me for Trader Joe's Petite Pumpkin Spice Cookies. Bottom line, seven out of ten. Not bad.